The unavoidable fate of the narcissist. Narcissists always manage to escape blame, punishment and undesirable consequences. While you are left in a state of lasting shock as a result of a disturbing experience. You are left stripped of your health, happiness and resources. And it looks like the narcissist is riding off into the sunset. They're beginning a new happy life as if you never existed. As though what they did to you is not important. And it may make you believe that there is no God. There is no higher power watching over us. So bad people are able to run rampant and get what they want. They're being rewarded for their bad behavior. While good people are being destroyed. It's like there is no karma. There is no good or bad luck resulting from our actions because nothing bad seems to be happening to the narcissist. While our lives are falling apart, it may seem like a lack of fairness and justice. It may seem like a violation of our rights. But trust and believe that they are getting their karma. Karma never loses an address. Every action, whether intentional or not, comes back to you. Karma never forgives or forgets. And the narcissist is getting their karma every day. Many of you may have been in situations where you lost your house, your car or your children. The narcissist may have taken all of your money. They may be enjoying their new lifestyle with their new partner at your expense while you're left without anything. You may have lost your job, you may be alone. And you may think that karma doesn't exist. Or you may think that it's not working. But money, relationships and material things are not the source of our happiness. Happiness comes from within. Happiness comes from who we're being. It has nothing to do with what you have or don't have. Which is how narcissists can have a lot of money, yet still be lacking the means to provide for themselves. Because they have no sense of being. They're not at peace with themselves. They're not grateful for their blessings because they're not grounded, compassionate or empathic. They have no true self. But you may feel unhappy as well. You may feel like you are lacking wealth and success. You may feel like you're not in the position that you desire to be in but you have the ability to heal yourself. You can release your trauma so that you achieve a higher level of consciousness. So that whether you achieve something that is moderate and small or grand and impressive, you will deeply appreciate it. But the narcissist will never have that. 
because they have no true sense of being. It's based on external sources. So they will never appreciate anything they have. They will always be stuck in an unpleasant situation that causes them a lot of suffering. Because no matter what they get, it will eventually become normal to them. They will get bored of it. They will find something wrong with it. And they will need something better to replace it. They may think that they finally found something to fill their inner void. But then they realize that's not perfect either. And it just drives them insane. It's killing them inside. They may seem happy with their new partner house or car. But those things soon begin to lack vitality and excitement. They begin to irritate the narcissist because they're not attractive enough. They're not expensive enough. They're not impressive enough. Because maybe someone else has something better. Which makes the narcissist feel like they're stuck in an unfortunate situation. And it is why they must constantly steal and use up other people's energy and resources. There are so many rich and famous people who are suffering from depression. They have drug addictions, they're suicidal, even though they have everything. Because they've never found peace and happiness within themselves. They thought money and possessions would provide that to them, but they have no true self. They have no sense of being. And that is why they can't give out feelings of joy from the lives that they are living. But I have seen plenty of my clients find happiness in their lives. I have seen them taking the focus off of what the narcissist is doing. I have seen them taking the focus off of what the narcissist has. And I have seen them return to good physical and mental health. It all starts by taking back your power and leaving the narcissist unable to affect you anymore. Many of my clients have done that. And they have seen the narcissist get their karma. They have seen the narcissist lose their new relationship partner. They have seen the narcissist lose their money and power. Because the narcissist just ends up shooting themselves in the foot. They end up getting more than what they bargained for. If you give them enough rope, they will hang themselves. If you allow them to continue on their course, they will suffer its consequences. Karma is real. So trust in its process. Whatever they think they've gotten away with, it will come back to them at some point in time. That same energy that they were given to you will eventually come back to them. Thank you for watching. 
I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching at narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.